Alright guys, Logan in the UK here, and in this video, um, you're going to see how I, uh, I don't know, just work out a code lock, just uh, using shapes, uh, random shapes and algorithms, step by steps, because um, uh, most people just do that really, use like L shapes, T shapes, just remember numbers, and don't actually give a fuck about the code, because it's rust, um, but yeah, enjoy the video, me cracking a code, and then the guy <laughs> trying to get his best back. So I actually took 37 attempts to crack the code or guess it, um, then to put my own code on the door, on the lock, and then to take the building privilege, and then the base was fully man, um, which was pretty good. So looking back, um, I realised that the code for this door was actually 7412, and there's the base owner running by to his base, coming back now, and um, he's in for a little surprise. As the code for this um, lock was 7412, which means it was an L shape, um, so it does work. And he's actually at his front door trying to guess his own code. <laughs> like, oh my god. He's actually hitting his own front door. So, I finally decide I might want to keep this base as like a second base. And then, um, I hear him building outside. So, I remember seeing just Twig. The fuck's he building? As you can hear me say. Um, just Twig up here, so I need to do some changes. So, I think we have a little battle here. So he is actually like building up the base again because there was um I don't know if you saw outside at the intro um there was a little uh, box with a uh, building proven and that's where he's building now because that's the only place he can build because I yeah uh, reset the building uh, privilege in um, inside the base so I am um, as quickly as I can I start upgrading all these walls so he can't jump in um he's causing a little trouble. Seeing as I decide to um, take over the base and keep it for myself, um, he was causing quite a distraction trying to do the process. So what I actually did is I went into a box and transferred all of my like stuff, so I could kill myself basically. Because what I did is I uh, planted a loot crate basically, um, not so far from the base, just before I went up to it in case I got killed, as I was uh, doing a little farm. Um, so I spawn and get my burn arrow in that and give him what he wants which is a little um, competition. Just gonna take a shot at him right now. Seeing as he's gonna fuck off. <laughs> Sorry sir. So just getting away from the door so I can get inside. Alright, I need to get him away just so I could get in, but as rust is rust, it's quite buggy and the door would not shut and he manages to get like a lucky shot, which totally pissed me off at the moment, but you know. To ensure that the base is mine and that I like, can keep coming back to it and do what I want really and use it as a second base um, all I need to do is um, block off this building proof because if he gets in through the roof like he's trying to do um, then he might just get his base back so 
So after taking out this dude a few times, he finally gives in and uh, he stops coming in and pissing me off. Um, but as you saw then, it was building blocks there because I don't have that. But I'll probably just see for it and get uh, access to it. But yeah, that's pretty much it. Get free base just by understanding patterns and, uh, and uh, shapes when people remember numbers. So if you enjoyed this video guys, just leave a like, share, comment down below and subscribe. Cheers.